and Estonia News are live on GBC News. The University of Environment and Sustainable Development, UESD, at Somania in the Eastern Region has commenced its maiden lectures to officially open the school to the public. The commencement lectures were adopted from the United States and will be carried out each year to begin academic activities. The vision to open a public university in the eastern region started years ago and in August last year, President Kufado commissioned the University of Environment and Sustainable Development, UESD. The objective of the school is to become a center of excellence in environmental and sustainable studies. Admissions for the first batch of students are ongoing till the 12th of February 2021, while lectures will fully begin on Monday 25th of January 2021. The chairman of the University Council, Professor Jonathan Na Aiti, commended governments for the establishment of the university and thanked the chiefs and people of the area for their immense support and cooperation in putting the school. A professor at the Department of Botany at the University of Ghana, Professor Alfred Otin Yabua, delivering a lecture on the topic Attitude as a primary and silent requirement in the service for national development expressed the hope the university will quickly mature and offer Ghanaians and the external market the urgent needed expertise, the delivery of safe environmental options. I want to posit that without the right attitude as a prerequisite in service for national development, the challenge to secure the environment will be a mirage. Simply put, it, our, it is our positive attitude to those natural bodies of our world which constitute our environment, including water, soil, air, and their composite elements, and which collectively sustain life that must be secured. The Deputy Director of the Ghana Tertiary Education Commission, GTEC, Dr. Ahmed Napo Abdullahi, said Ghana has over the years tried to secure its environment through a number of legislations and actions, yet the outcome has not been impressive. As a country, where the order of the day is one of block drains, flooding, open defecation, inappropriate disposal of wastes, lack of a recycling culture, and many opening diseases such as malaria and cholera, definitely is challenged when it comes to its environment. And it's on this note that the vision, mission, and mandate of University of Environment and Sustainable Development in the environmental developmental agenda of this nation cannot and should not be whitewashed. As the first public university in the eastern region, infrastructure is still being expanded in the school with get fund constructing an administration block, auditorium, ICT library, and a lecture hall, which are all at various stages of completion. Courses run in the school include BSc Sustainable Development, BSc Chemistry and Mathematics, BSc Geography and Earth Science, and BSc Water Resources Development and Mathematics, among others. <laughs>